Hello. Hi, my name is Devin. I'm going to be the nurse today. I'm going to perform a head to toe assessment on you. I'm going to provide privacy, wash my hands. Um, my client appears his stated age. He has good posture, shows no signs of illness. Uh, can I get your name? Noah. And what's your birthday? 225.95. Okay, good. And uh, do you know where you are right now? Yep, the hospital. And what's today? Today is April 9th. Good. My client is alert and oriented times three. Um, he's in a pleasant mood. He has appropriate behavior and his speech is clear. Uh, are you experiencing any pain right now? No, I am not. Any allergies? Nope. Alright, good. His eyes are symmetrical. Um, they are reactive to light and his pupils are round and equal. And accommodate. Good. Um, can you open your mouth for me? His oral mucosa is moist uh, and pink. Can you smile? His teeth are white and all present. His gums have no swelling. They're pink and moist. Uh, open up again. Say ah. Ah. His uvula is mobile and is in the midline. His tongue is pink and moist as well. And his tonsils are graded at a 2+. plus. Good. Okay. Now I'm going to palpate the carotid arteries. And... Uh, they're equal bilaterally, 2 plus. Good. Um, skin is warm. Uh, it's equal bilaterally. And there's no lesions present. Good. Now I'm going to auscultate for a brewery. Okay. No brewery present. Uh, can you stick out your arms for me? Thank you. Okay, no lesions present on the upper extremities. Uh, color is uniform. And temperature is warm and equal bilaterally. Okay, can you flip your hands? Thank you. Actually, the nails um, are at 160 degree base and no clubbing. Uh, stick out your hands, please. Like this. Okay, capillary refill is less than three seconds. Good. Turn your hands. Okay, the radio pulses are equal bilaterally, two plus. And the brachial pulses are uh, equal bilaterally as well, two plus. Good. Um, now I'm going to check for upper arm strength. Could you uh, grasp my hands? Thank you. Upper arm strength is equal bilaterally. Okay, now I'm going to check the heart. The aortic area is at the second inner space, um, right of the sternum. And the pulmonic area is at the second inner space, left of the sternum. Herb's point is at the third inner space, left of the sternum. <clears throat> the tricuspid area is at the fifth intercostal space left of the sternum and the mitral area is at the fifth inner, inner space um, at the mid clavicle line and this is where you would listen to the apical rate for 60 seconds okay and I'm gonna reverse the diaphragm to the bell and start here at the mitral area No murmurs, uh, normal heart sounds. Good. And now I'm going to listen for lung fields, lung sounds. Just take a deep breath for each placement, please. Uh, can you sit up? Thank you.
Okay. The lung fields are clear and um, no crackles or anything like that. Could you please stand up? Thank you. Um, can you bend over? Okay. The spine is straight and symmetrical. Um, sit down again for me, please. Tell me if you feel any um, tenderness or pain. I'm going to test for CVA tenderness. Okay, and please get up for me one more time. Alright, the A and P diameter to transverse diameter is uh, 1 to 2, which is normal. Good. Um, now can I have you lay down for me? Thank you. Okay, um, abdomen contour is uh, flat and uh, there's no signs of scarring or edema. Now I'm going to lightly palpate. Tell me if you feel any pain or tenderness. No. Nope. Okay, good. Um, Tymphony over all the quadrants and dullness over the spleen and liver. And now I'm going to listen to the bowel sounds on all four quadrants. Okay, normal bowel sounds in all uh, quadrants, gurgling, which is good. Um, cool. And now I'm going to have you, uh, or I'm going to name the organs. Um, at the right lower quadrant, you have the um, right spermatic cord, the cecum, and the appendix. At the right upper quadrant, you got the liver, the um, gallbladder. And at the left upper quadrant, you got the stomach, the spleen, the splenetic flexure of the colon. Okay. And at the left lower quadrant, you have the descending colon. Um, you have uh, the left spermatic cord. And yeah. Okay. Now I'm going to have you uh, get up for me, please. Okay. No jugular vein distension noticed. Um, I'm going to check the lower extremities for edema, temperature. Okay, uh, the skin color is uniform, temperature is warm and equal bilateral. There's no lesions or edema present. Now I'm going to check your popliteal pulse. Has a 1 plus grade and is equal bilaterally. Your tibial pulse has a 1 plus grade and is equal bilaterally. And the dorsalis pedius pulse. has a 1 plus grade and is equal bilaterally as well. Okay? Good. Now can I have you uh, stand up for me? Thank you. Uh, put your arms together and your feet together and close your eyes. This is the Romberg test. Okay, okay good. You can open your eyes. Um, my client uh, stayed balanced, good stability, um, and is not dizzy. Can you uh, please walk over there? and walk back to me. Okay, gait is normal. Um, he stayed balanced, no dizziness. And please sit down one more time for me. Put your feet up. Okay, good. Uh, negative Bobinski test.